Difference between Wi-Fi router and access point? I see both terms used, and I was wondering what the difference is between a Wi-Fi router and a Wi-Fi access point. Does the latter only create a LAN, with no way to connect the Wi-Fi box with the second network? Thank you. Access point is just a bridge between wired and wireless networks. It only operates in first and second layer. It doesn't perform any third layer operations, routing, NAT-ing, IP filtering. For the most part the two are used interchangeably, however, technically there is a difference and for the most part consumers only use Wi-Fi routers. A Wi-Fi router is a Wi-Fi access point with a built-in router. The router allows you to connect multiple computers to the network using a single IP address, typically provided by your ISP. A Wi-Fi access point is typically used only in enterprise networks where they have a larger router which routes their entire network and the access point only acts as a gateway between the wired and wireless networks. The access point acts as an Ethernet switch, has one Ethernet port and allows Wi-Fi stations to access the same LAN the access point is in. The router will typically have four Ethernet ports, one special Ethernet port called Internet, and will allow creating a new subnet for the Wi-Fi, with DHCP acting as the default gateway for this subnet. I'm 11 years late, but here's my answer. They're not the same because the first contains the word router in it. Let me elaborate. A router routes between networks. A router may or may not have wireless capabilities. If it does, it will have one or two, if it's dual band, physical radio interfaces, and one or more corresponding virtual app interfaces for each of those. I specifically said radio, rather than app, because some, depending on the firmware, will let you set the operation mode of the radio to something else other than app mode, for example WDS client etc. The point here is, when someone says router and app, they mainly refer to the physical device. A better way of looking at it is not at the device itself, but at what it does, at its features. Anyway. An app contains the app interface I described in the first part of the answer above, but without the routing capabilities of the router, since it's only an app. That is, a dedicated app device is the same as the app on wireless router, but without the router part and thus normally cheaper. My point about looking at devices in terms of what they do, rather than what they're labeled as physically is about the fact that a device that has multiple functions of things that have different names makes for ambiguity. For example, a router could easily be set so that it doesn't do any routing and simply acts only as an app and nothing more, as an entry point for clients into the network of a primary router. It doesn't really make sense to refer to it as a router when it doesn't operate as such. Similarly, I'm now holding in my hands what you'd call a repeater, terminology is at its most conflicting here, almost every website outlining differences that are at odds with others' ideas, but it has two modes on its interface I can set it to, repeater and app mode. I'm calling it repeater since I'm now using it in repeater mode, but if I switch it over to app mode, things become unclear if I continue calling it repeater. If you want to support the channel, please consider subscribing.